<laughs> okay, everyone, remember how to play? Whichever team steals the carrot nose off the other team's snowman and brings it back to their snowman scores a point. Ready? Set. Wait! I just realized our teams are uneven. Our team has four. You guys only have three. Hey. Yeah. You're right. Well, uh, I guess I could referee. shelf? Not as impossible as it seems? Oh, what am I going to do with this? But it is the biggest first frost gift ever. I got it! This is the perfect secret gift for my secret gifty. Plum! <laughs> She's gonna... So I can be a good citizen. Do you want to be in the Good Citizens Club? Yes. I can't hear you. Yes. I still can't hear you. Yes. You must take the test of good citizenness. Whatever it is, I'll do my very best. Yes, yes, yes. So. Your first test will be to paint the clubhouse inside and out so it looks nice before the first meeting of the Good Citizens Club. Inside and out? <sighs> uh, is that too hard? Because instead you could... Absolutely not too hard for me. I am happy to do my best to make the Good Citizens Club look fabulous for everyone. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Start on that side. You're blocking my tan over there. I don't know. I think that blue clashes with my eyes. Can you do a lighter shade? What's that? Here, give me the paintbrush. more 
like it. That looks like a rabbit. It looks like a flower. It doesn't. Does too. It doesn't. Does too. It doesn't. <sighs> Finished. Exactly the way we wanted it. Are you sure you think it's not good? Should you do it over? No, no, it looks terrific, really. Let's wait to get the other member's opinion before we go changing anything. So is that it? Do I get my pin now? Well, uh, you finished the first test. Congratulations! First test? How many are there? Uh, uh three. Yeah, three skirts. Yeah, we always use three. Uh-huh, that's right. Oh. <sighs> to this year's Very Bitty Buggy Derby. <laughs> You're all going to have a wonderful time. So please, help me welcome the official Very Bitty Buggy Derby driver. <laughs> present our esteemed Derby Drivers. <sighs> oh no, they've forgotten how to do the introduction. <laughs> oh yeah, I remember now. <laughs> Thanks, Blueberry. Done. I bet she forgot. And with this traditional ceremonial derby scepter, I hereby declare that the derby has begun. <laughs> what a wonderful ceremony! Just like the old days. Thanks to you, Blueberry. I think you've shown the princess very good manners by so closely following the traditions of her favorite event. Thanks. I do feel I've made it up to the princess for my bad manners earlier. At least a little. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Oh! Excuse me. No, excuse me. Uh, who, wh where'd you come from? Very Bitty City. I'm Strawberry Shortcake. I live there with my friends. Oh, hi there. I'm Huckleberry Pie. Hello. I'm Orange. Hi, I'm Cherry. Hello, Huckleberry. I'm Blueberry. Ed. <laughs> I'm Earl. Where are you headed? Not anywhere now. I'm kind of stuck. Hmm. Not for long, you aren't. Yeah! Woohoo! Yes! <gasps> okay, now settle down. Behave yourselves. <laughs> so nice, so sweet, so bouncy. Puppies! So adorable! <laughs> Come here! <laughs> Come back! Is this how guests behave? <sighs> You're so lucky to have so many pets! Oh, Lemon, they aren't mine. Whose are they? Well, uh, nobody's. <gasps> <laughs> hey, come back! Cupcake, come back here! Good morning, Strawberry! Good morning, Plum! Good morning, Strawberry! Good morning, Blueberry! Good morning, Strawberry! 
Hi, Raspberry! Hi, Strawberry! Morning, Lemon! Mmm, what's that fragrance? Oh, my new lemon hair scent. Like it? Oh, delicious! Great! I have a new strawberry scented shampoo that'd be perfect for you. Stop by later, I'll give you some! Thank you! <laughs> Morning, Orange! Morning, Strawberry! Where are you off to? Soon as I can catch Pupcake to Berry Glen for some strawberries. Need anything while I'm there? Oh, uh, yes. Pick me a few sunflower seeds? You got it. Pupcake! give my secret gift D, Mr. Longface. Something he would really, really like. <laughs> Thanks, Pupcake. And then it hit me, a plant for the entrance to his croquet club. And I know just the perfect plant. Oh, oops, I almost forgot my rope. <laughs> wow! That's the most ginormous first frost gift I've ever seen! I knew that was a good choice for Plum! Oh, nice! A book! Chapter 137, Sorting Your Encyclopedias. The A to Z of how to and how not to. Hmm... Maybe not exactly the most must-have gift I've ever received for First Frost. I know! My secret gifty Orange likes to sort things. I bet she'd love this! <gasps> oh, yes, yes. Indeed, yes. It is getting chilly these days, Miss Jadybug. Uh, you know, I have an extra hat you could borrow. Very warm. Hello? Well, hello! <laughs> Aren't you the most wonderfully oversized first frost gift? Grab and move. Grab and move. Here it is! Mr. Longface will be thrilled when he sees his gift. And I'm gonna get it for him. Ugh. No matter what. Ta-da! Raspberry will love a gift this big. She can 
could use it as a footstool when she sews. Or to hide a refrigerator. I did it! Oh, Mr. Longface is gonna love you, little plant. Huh? 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 Achoo! Oh, muffin crumbs. Oh, hibiscus always makes my nose itch. dresses for us so quickly, Raspberry. They're beautiful. And so fancy. <laughs> Gee, well, thank you. I mean, it's just what I do. Where's Blueberry? What's she wearing? A lot of notes. Huh? Good evening, Mr. Bumblebee. My, you're looking well this evening. Uh, well, th thank, thank you, Blueberry. You're also looking... Offer to shake hands. Oh, yeah. Blueberry, what are you doing? Good evening, Miss Pudding. My, you're looking well this evening. That's what you said to the postmaster. It's me, Plum. I just want to have the best manners possible so everything goes well. For the princess, don't you think you're overdoing it just a little bit? When it comes to good manners, there's no such thing as overdoing it. Hi, Berry King Blue. Don't forget to shake hands. Huh? Uh. This is the derby ball, after all. We have to be proper. Raspberry, it's impolite not to wait your turn. But, uh... Jadybug told me to go ahead of her because she's still deciding. No, no, no. No bad manners at this ball. <laughs> Orange, what are you doing? Oh, uh, I'm just going to rest a second. Ooh, I was dancing my feet off out there. But, but you're slouching. That's not good manners. It isn't? Oh. Oh, it's okay. No one can see me. But somebody might. And what if it's the princess? There. Perfect. Psst. Plum, is your napkin in your lap? Uh, yes. Don't chew with your mouth open. Wasn't going to. No elbows on the table. Do you see them on the table? Be sure not to slurp your tea. Ugh. Anything else? Yes, sit up straight. Hey, where's Blueberry? She's busy, minding everybody else's manners. What's that? Well, you see, she's been running around correcting everyone's manners whenever they make a mistake. She corrected me before I even made a mistake. She really needs to relax. Blueberry, enjoying the ball? Well, no. Why not? Oh, Strawberry, I'm just so worried someone is going to offend the princess with bad manners. I think you should just try to have fun. You don't need to worry about how things are going. Okay. Just as soon as I finish the chapter on the salad fork, the misunderstood utensil. <laughs> Looks like they feel right at home. Well, I hope you do too. Oops! <laughs> Almost forgot my guys. some sunflower seeds for orange.
flowers. Strawberry Shortcake, you are out early today. What is all this? My latest, greatest invention. A plant food that grows very many fruits and vegetables. No more rolling apples all the way into town. Now they're just the right size for us. Mmm, very delicious too. I have a suggestion. I think our anything that's fun rule might work a little better if we mix up the teams. Yeah! 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 Blueberry, plum, and cherry. You guys form a team with three berrykins on this side. And the other three berrykins can form a team with raspberry, orange, and lemon. Now, each team will have the same advantages. Oh, no! Look! Uh-oh. It's melting! Quick, get some more snow! Do something! Oh, there it goes. Oh, snow! I'm sorry, Strawberry. It's just too warm. The snowmaking machine can't keep its cool. Thanks for trying, Berrykin Bruce. Aw. Well, that's it. Fun while it lasted. Just when we worked out the teams. <sighs> Guess we'll have to wait till next winter. Yeah. Aww. Aww. Hold on, everybody. Gather round. What if we made our snowman out of something other than snow? Oh, anybody have any ideas of what we can use to build a snowman that's white and fluffy? You mean besides mashed potatoes? <laughs> mashed potatoes! <laughs> that's it! <laughs> hey, I was joking! I'm not! <laughs> it could work! Come on, everybody! Like winter. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have put away my winter fashions. Do you think it's too cold and windy to play? <laughs> yes, and it'll be getting dark soon. Let's come back in the morning. Meanwhile, hot chocolate for everyone at the cafe. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Blueberry. Come back to let me finish your hair? Um, no, Lemon. Uh, I know this is supposed to be secret, but I need to give this gift to you in person and explain why. But what for? It's for First Frost. But, uh, uh, I already got a secret gift. I know, I gave it to you. But it wasn't a secret gift that you would like. It was something I would like. So, here's a secret gift I think you'll like. 
Oh, Blueberry! The very big book of bountiful braiding. Just what I always wanted. That's the perfect first frost gift for me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh what? Uh-oh, I just realized I didn't give Plum the perfect first frost gift. I just gave her the book you gave me. I know. Sorry, Blueberry. Wait! I have just the thing for Plum. you wouldn't like it as much as the very big book on book sorting. This gift is even better because it shows me that you really thought about what I like, something only a friend would know. Uh-oh, is this bad manners? <laughs> well, maybe, but I didn't mind. I'm sorry, the race was just so exciting I forgot. I'm so glad you guys can understand and forgive me when I goof up. What can I say? That's what friends are for. <laughs> now, that was the most fun I've had in ages. Somebody ought to tell the princess that we should do that every year. Did you hear that? The princess will be so happy. Hey, Blueberry, you know what else friends are for? <laughs> Celebrating when something great happens. <laughs> Dinner? Uh, is this part of my bed sheet? Oh, Strawberry, I give up. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I fell asleep and they stayed awake. I guess you could say they, uh... Redecorated? It's what pups do. Strawberry, you've been so kind. And then this. I insist on fixing your room. That might take some time. However long it takes, I promise I'll put it back the way it was. That's very honorable of you. You're welcome to stay as long as it takes, then. <gasps> Need some more trash bags? <laughs> Galloping gooseberries! <laughs> radishes and rutabagas! Who wanted the radishes and rutabagas? <laughs> you know what? Who else for tomatoes, potatoes, turnips, and Excuse me. Um, pardon me. Beg your 
break just now. Papayas and peaches! Who ordered the papayas and... Right here, right here, right here! Just a bit busy. dogs. Um, can we talk to you about that? Would it be possible for me to adopt Hannah? Hannah? What happened to the Dalmatian? <laughs> Doesn't Cinepop have an incredible voice? And Pitter Patch is a great dancer. Doesn't Chiffon look fabulous? Um, where is Chiffon? <laughs> we decided to swap dogs. And perfect matches were made. Isn't that so scouty? <laughs> what do you say, Huckleberry? Of course. Well, I suppose I'll adopt Biscuit. But I haven't seen him for a while. He's kind of a rover. There he is. I'll oh, take you with us. Come here, boy. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> no wonder he didn't stay with any of us. He's been your dog all along. Well, Huckleberry, will you let him adopt you? <laughs> I think Tom Tom already has. Oh.